So dear parents and students, welcome back to another video in Test Prep Card channel. I believe all of you are doing great and staying safe. So what we are going to cover in today's video. Today's video is very informative for those students who are targeting Anna University. Today we are going to discuss about the fee structure of Anna University, particularly for the NRI students. All right. So this video is going to be very informative. Just a small request, folks. Please don't put your phone down. Keep watching till the end. You will really enjoy. All right. Let's start this video. Now, let me just tell you what are the things that we are going to cover in next 10 minutes. We will discuss about the tuition fee of UG and PG courses. We'll discuss about the mode of payment that how one can pay the fee. We'll discuss also about the program fee for this current year, which is 2021. And we will also discuss about the Center of International Relation. Now, Center of International Relation is a body which deals with all the foreign students issues. All right. So we are going to cover in this video. Let's start today's video without wasting much time. All right briefly discussing about the tuition fee structure for the UG, PG and all the integrated master's courses. In here, this is given that this is for the year 2018 to the 2019, but the fee is same for this current year as well. Okay. For the UG degree program, for the bachelor's courses, the fees is US dollar 7500. Okay. For the PG degree program, the fees is 4000 US dollars. Okay, and for the all masters or integrated courses, which is a course of five years, the fees is 5000 US dollars. All right. So this is just a information about the fees. Now, how one can pay this fee? So let me discuss about the mode of payment. There are basically two types of mode of payment in here. The first one is DD and the second one is called SWIFT transfer, right? SWIFT transfer. So let me just discuss about the demand draft, which is DD. So for the demand draft, you need to do a process. The process is very clear. You need to frame a DD. You need to just prepare a demand draft of whatever amount you are enrolling in or whichever course you are enrolling in. Let's say if you're enrolling in UG or let's say you are enrolling in PG or the integrated five year course, you need to pay that amount, which is US dollar 7,500, US dollar 4,000, US dollar 5,000 at New York and in the favor of Director Center of International Affairs, Anna University, Chennai, 600025. This is a body which deals with all the payment of NRI students. Also, if you want to pay in Indian rupee, then again, you need to frame a demand draft in Indian rupee equivalent to the same amount, which is 7,500 US dollars, 4,000 US dollars and 5,000 US dollars payable at Chennai in the favor of Director, Center of International Affairs, Anna University, Chennai and again 600025. Okay. And again, in here, exchange rate certificate from bank should be submitted along the demand draft. This is the mandate information and mandate documentation that you need to present before the payment. All right. Just a brief about the demand draft. Let me just move on to the SWIFT transfer. For the SWIFT transfer, this is as such that there are intermediary banks like just like Bank of America or New York. There's a SWIFT code and the code is BOFAUS3N. You have to use this code and the beneficiary banks are Canara Bank, International Division, Mumbai. Okay. And the SWIFT field is 57. SWIFT code is CNRBINBBBBID. The account number is 655-079-1917. And the account number, as I just told, there is another account number. If there is a beneficiary is in the serial number 59, it falls in the serial number 59. Then in that particular case, the amount, the account number is 8456101111 You have to just just you know to fill this information in here if you're just doing the payment through swift transfer again the bank address is canada bank anna university branch tamil nadu chennai 25 and you should having an account and this is also given in here but also if someone who is studying in this college they have to have an account in canada bank and this anna university campus right just for the fees transfer right or when the parents are sending money to these children so this bank uh, the student has to have an account in this bank all right this is the information important information all right let's let me announce a very important part here for the nri students this is particularly this video for is for the nri students so for the nri students we have prepared an nri ebook that's related to dassciwg you can download it from the link in the description below. We have a compiled set of NRI ebooks. Okay, you can download it. Let's move on. This is for the NRI students. All right, now let me just discuss about the program fees for the batch 2021. Okay, so 
Typically, there are few top colleges in Anna University. I am going to cover that top colleges in another video, right? Top 10 colleges. So if I just discuss about the College of Engineering, that is Gindi campus. And if I talk about the bachelor fees, which is BE in Biomedical Engineering, BE in Chemical Engineering, BE in Civil Engineering, BE in Computer Science, BE in Geoinformatics, now BE in Industrial Engineering, mechanical engineering and manufacturing engineering you need to pay the fees 7500 us dollars all right again btech in chemical engineering btech in industrial biotechnology the fees is same if i talk about mit that's madras institute of technology mit the fees is also same for the respective courses like aeronautical engineering automobile engineering right computer science and engineering electronics and communication engineering btech in it Okay, BE in production engineering, BE in mechanical engineering. So again, the fee is very reasonable because this is a government institution. The fees obviously be reasonable, right? Which is 7,500 US dollars. If I talk about the College of Engineering Gindi campus and now this is particularly for the fees in other domain, right? Like in agricultural, in material science, in mining, in printing technology, in mechanical engineering, right? And again, if you talk about other courses like rubber and plastic technology, BE in rubber and plastic technology, right? Automobile engineering, civil engineering, computer science and engineering, right? And etc. So for this, you need to pay the fee is 5,000 US dollars. Again, a very reasonable price, all right? Let me just tell you about the post-graduation fees for the year 2021. For this year, the fees is US dollar 2000. 2000 US dollar is for the PG in all the branches, right? And just to give you a sum up that in the UG, this was 7500 US dollars. And in some other courses, it was 5000 US dollars. And in the post graduation, this is 2000 US dollars. A very genuine fees, all right? Because this is a government institution. All right, let me just briefly discuss about the Center of International Relation. Now, Center of International Relation is a body which deals with all the foreign affairs, right? The more like foreign exchange, student exchange program, all that things, all that activities in under university is being handled by this body, which is Center of International Relation. Let me just tell you about this. What is it? So Center of International Relation, which is called CIR, coordinates bilateral research and academic programs with overseas institution, the overseas institution of the university through memorandum of understanding that's MOU exchange of faculties exchange of students foreign language programs and conducts of international joint seminars and conferences a great body in here if I talk about the present status of this body at present the university has established academic and research collaboration with more than 40 foreign universities institutions through memorandum of understanding CIR has overall, if I talk about the professors, then professor schemes is just like 30 professors from USA, right, from Germany, Australia, Japan, Sweden, France, Italy, Switzerland, and England, right? So there is, you know, a diversity of faculties in here, right? The overseas professors have been visiting Anna University Chennai and interacting with faculties and students. So this is a great thing in here, just to impart the quality education, just to impart the diversity amongst the students, amongst the faculties. This university is into the power. This is actually working on it. All right. And again, this is a government institution. So the fees is really going to be low. The placements are also good. The return on investment is also high. I just covered that thing in the coming videos. Okay. So keep updated. All right, I'm just continuing with the CSR thing again, CIR thing again. CIR is responsible for the admission of students under foreign scheme, foreign nationals, non-resident Indians, that is NRI, people from Indian origin, that's PIO, and children of Indian workers in Gulf country, that is CIWGC, for undergraduate courses and for the post-graduation courses. The center also conducts foreign language courses such as German, French, Japanese for faculty members and students. Now, this is a very great thing in here. The universities like Jamia, the universities like Genio in Delhi is also doing the same thing. Again, that is a government institution. That's a government body. That's a government college. So now these colleges are actually the college of national repute, right? So if you're pursuing any courses from here is of the great value. 
right in addition the center supports exchange of faculties and students on short and long term visits to, to the institution that have mou so students who are studying in here may be given a chance maybe many times given a chance to you know visit some other countries for research work for placements for interaction for exchange there are much thing in here right so again this is a very good university a great university i can say and if you are getting a chance to admit in this university please do it all right so this is just a uh, complete information about the fee structure of anna university a complete information of fee structure of anna university for the nri nationals nri students all right again if you have any doubts you can ask in the comment section below and again subscribe our youtube channel test prep card also press the bell icon so that you won't miss any updates from us stay tuned stay connected thank you